was that King Disease Three. You know that King Disease man, like yeah. just hit boy. You know he just found he found a partner, a, a producer to kind of lock in with. Because I think a lot of times a lot of these artists they be getting these beats from all they get beat packs from all these different people, and yeah. then you try to yep. make an album out of fifty songs and don't sound cohesive. Versus like back in the yep. day when these artists were actually in the they was in the booth together. And they working hand in hand. They creating these tracks like the producer created right there on on the spot, and then the, um, yep. the rapper go in the booth and rap on it. Versus you getting three or four or five beats from one one producer over here, another producer give you five beats, and then you picking you know picking all these beats and it don't sound cohesive. But this one right here was a yeah. really solid project, and he just been on the run with with um with Hit Boy. It's gonna be kind of funny, kind of see him with his next project to move away from Hit Boy if he decide to move away from Hit Boy and see how. It go it, it either go up or down, and then to kind of tell us is it True. was it more hit boy or was it him, and we'll kind of determine was it hit boy or was it him. He should stay with him. You know boy. what I'm saying? Like he should stay yeah. with him. Can boy. you continue? Can you keep you know elevating with the same with the same producer because he's been putting out some solid projects. Like he brought Nas back. Like you know Nas was like we. Well, you got to think like you said though. You said like the artists back in the day. So I'm just throwing the name out there. So like you say with Juvenile or Hot Boys with Manny Fresh. They continue to put them out uh, with Hit Boy. Yep. I mean, with um, Solid Project Manny Fresh. So, so I, yeah. yeah, I think he can do it. To be honest with you, I would like. Yeah, him like to I said, you got three out of them. Yeah, you got three of them. After a while, yeah, after a while, you know, you kind of you kind of know what to expect now. Um, you know, um, Hit Boy's not going to switch yep. up too much from what he does, you know, right? So, and then he's getting a bigger name. You know, Nas is really putting him out there as, mm. like, an, uh, a producer to really, you know what I'm saying, to go to. I would like to yep. see him and Alchemist get together yep. and do some stuff. I would like to see him and Harry Fraud, which I know Harry Fraud is slowly going down a list when it comes to, as far as, like, top producers. Man, I'll even throw Static Select out there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I mean, just because it gives a different feel. And Al, Static, they're giving you that new New York vibe, that new Griselda vibe, BSL vibe. You know, you you getting all you you getting all that music, all that great music that's coming out of New York. You know, hey, why not throw the greatest artist from New York on a track? You know, on, on a couple tracks. And put a project out there, so I think something like that. Yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, too, it's gonna be know? nice to see who he, who he rock with next. Because, like I said, he didn't got three projects out of Hit Boy, and it was some solid projects. And to keep doing, it, I think it'll dilute it at some point, and then you'll start having to like, oh man, it's kind of falling off versus yeah. leaving at the peak and then rocking with yeah. somebody else, and then we'll be able to. Because three, it's a solid three number is a solid number. You can go back and through, be like, you know what. Man, I'm, I'm I'm headed to Mississippi, so shoot, mm. I can ride and I can listen to, you know, these three albums, and you know, yeah. Tennessee. And I'm not saying like, he can't you grab know? a couple of beats from. He's um, trying to switch up from from Hit Boy, but just the whole project. I think it kind of it's time to kind of like grab somebody else and see if they can kind of yeah, it can switch it up and get a different sound. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Because you get tired mm -hmm. of the same sound yeah. over and over and over. Because yeah. you know, like I said, Hit Boy gonna make those type of beats where you know it's gonna be Hit Boy type beats. Woo! So. 